This is AP News Minute. For the first time ever, an interrogation that took place at Guantanamo Bay is seen on video. The suspect is Omar Kadar, a Canadian citizen who was accused of killing a U.S. soldier during a 2002 firefight in Afghanistan. Lawyers for Kadar, who released the tape, say the seven-hour video, taken over four days of interviews, shows the effects of prolonged interrogation and detention. Fed Chairman Ben Bernanke heads to Capitol Hill this morning, where he'll testify before a Senate panel about the economy. The chairman is expected to address the slumping housing market and provide details on the Fed's plan to crack down on shady mortgage lending practices. The District of Columbia City Council votes today on emergency legislation allowing handguns in the nation's capital. The Supreme Court recently struck down the city's 32-year-old ban on handguns. If passed, the measure will still require all legal firearms, including handguns, rifles, and shotguns, to be kept in homes and equipped with trigger locks. Josh Hamilton may not have won last night's home run derby, but he was definitely the star of the show, lighting up the event by hitting a record 28 homers in the first round. The Rangers slugger fell short in the finals as the Twins' Justin Morneau took home the trophy. John Belmont, the Associated Press, with AP News Minute.